not what I heard. Why are you looking so doubtful? I see that you bear the sign of the Ring of Water. So, are you a member That's too? Something. What if I am? Then I would tell you that Lares wants to be relieved from his post down at the harbor. Fine. If that's so, I'll see to it that somebody deals with it. I see. He can't keep anything to himself. Show me your wares. He can't keep anything to himself. Don't tell this to anyone. Everybody knows by now. That's not what I heard. I don't believe that. What can I do for you? Are you seeking spiritual comfort? Do you want to direct a prayer to our Lord Enos, or donate some gold for his church? And he works all day, too. I need to talk to the paladins. Can you help me get to them? Well. You need access to the That's upper well, end of there. town. However, this is allowed only Someone to citizens the and the city guard. And of course, to us, magicians of fire. How can I become a fire magician? You must join our order as a novice. When you have That's served for a time, perhaps you will be accepted into the ranks of the magicians. However, the path to acceptance is long and full of work and study. Can't take care of everything for everybody. Tell me more about the monastery. We instruct our students in all forms of magic, but the arts of the magicians of fire consist of more than these alone. We are also well versed in the art of alchemy and in the creation of powerful runes. <laughs> we also make excellent wine. He'd better shut up. Where do you come from? I come from the Monastery of the Magicians, which lies in the mountains. That's terrible. We accept everyone there who is pure of heart and feels the desire to serve our almighty Lord in us. Who says things like that? He can't keep anything to himself. What are you doing in town? I have discussions with the paladins and support the citizens with my advice and with Honestly, helpful words. Particularly in these difficult he times, it is our duty to be there for the people and to help the poor. Me. Tell me about Inos. Inos, our almighty lord, is the light and the fire. He chooses humans to be his tool, giving them magic and laws. We act in his name. We administer justice according to his will and preach his word. I've come to get your blessing. That's good. That's good. Then you will probably want to donate gold to the Holy Church of Enos, won't you? Actually, I wanted your blessing so I can sign on as an apprentice in the lower part of town. But my son, without a modest donation to the church, it is impossible for me to bless you. How else can I be certain of your good intentions toward the Holy Church of Enos? So, how much does a donation usually run to here? Well, that depends on what percentage you want to give, son. <laughs> Let me see how much you brought. Hmm. Hmm. Well, you don't have much, but neither are you poor. Hmm. Ten gold pieces for Inos. We live modestly. I bless you in the name of Inos, for he is light and righteousness. I am poor. So, you are impoverished. No wonder in these times. Take this gold. It should help you. But you should look for work. Then you will see how quickly gold comes to you. And then you may give to the church of Inos as she has given to you. How's business? When the Paladins came, I first thought that it was a good business opportunity, but they let Herod make their weapons, and neither Hacka nor I make even one gold piece off them. Moreover, the farmers no longer supply us with food, and all the prices have gone up. It's only a small consolation that the Paladins are paying my hotel bill. What's the problem with the farmers? They refuse to deliver their goods. Now that the ships no longer come in, 
The city depends entirely on the supplies provided by the farmers, of course. An owner, the largest farmer, has hired mercenaries to protect his farm from the city guards. Otherwise, they simply snatch the goods for themselves. But the mercenaries don't just guard Onar's farm. They come as far as the small farms outside of town to intimidate the farmers. I saw them as I was passing Akil's farm. I wouldn't like to be in his shoes now. Where will I find Akil's farm? If you go out of the east gate here and follow the road to the right, you'll come to a stairway. It leads up to Akil's farm, but I wouldn't go there now. The mercenaries are certainly still there. Show me your wares. I'm Zurus, master of potions. Do you need an essence of healing or a magic elixir? Then you've come to the right place. Do you brew your own potions? No, I either get them from the monastery or I buy them from Constantino, the alchemist. If you're interested in brewing potions, then talk to him. He needs an assistant. But he's too pig-headed to hire someone himself. He's just as stubborn as a mule. He always passes me when he goes out on the East Gate to collect plants for his potions. Where exactly does Constantino gather his herbs? He always goes through the Eastern City Gate here and then disappears into the wilderness to the left. He once told me that just about everything grows there, except for King Sorrel. Has Constantino ever told you where to find King Sorrel? I once heard him say that the stuff grows near stone circles, near Lobart's farm. That's a farm near the other gate. There's one of those stone circles. I think it's on a hill. It used to be a grave or something. Show me your wares. Show me your wares. About those missing people. Just leave me alone with that. I've got other problems. I've come to collect the bounty for a criminal. Sarah is selling weapons to Onar. Sarah? The weapons merchant in the marketplace? Do you have proof of that? She has a letter in her pocket which details the delivery of arms to him. She won't get away with that. I shall have her arrested. What do you want here? By reason of the imminent danger of an attack by horse. What can you tell me about this area? These are the barracks. Where do you want to go? 
skills of combat immediately and to arm him. Where's the harbor district? Just walk down the stairs to the right at the main entrance and you'll get to the gallows square. Walk down the alley from the gallows square and you'll come to the temple square. There is an underpass which leads to the lower part of town from the temple square. Walking down the harbor road from the smithy will take you to the harbor. I'm looking for the temple. Just walk down the stairs to the left at the main entrance and you'll get to the marketplace. Walking along the high city wall from the marketplace will take you to the temple. How do I get to the gallows square? Just walk down the stairs to the right at the main entrance and you'll get to the gallows square. Where's the marketplace? Just walk down the stairs to the left at the main entrance and you'll get to the marketplace. How do I get to the upper quarter? Just walk down the stairs to the right at the main entrance and you'll get to the gallows square. Walk down the alley from the gallows square and you'll come to the temple square. There is an underpass which leads to the lower part of town from the temple square. A flight of stairs leads up from the southern city gate to the inner city gate. That's where the upper part of town begins. How do I get to the lower part of town? Just walk down the stairs to the right at the main entrance and you'll get to the gallows square. Walk down the alley from the gallows square and you'll come to the temple square. There is an underpass which leads to the lower part of town from the temple square. Thanks, that's all I wanted to know. I want to see the prisoners. Go ahead, but I'll stay away too long, understood? You, you dare show your face here. I cannot prove it, but I bet that you played a part in this dirty game. It's your fault that I'm here. Yours and that of this damned Canthar. May Inos punish you. All the citizens of this city who have martial skills at their disposal are here with urge to join the royal militia. Show me your wares. Well done. Sarah is where she belongs. I have taken over her goods, so if you need a weapon, come to me. You were going to give me a weapon? Correct. Here, this weapon is a masterpiece of the blacksmith's art. Show me your wares. Take your pick. I've got to go. Suit yourself.
But so great was the wrath of Beliar that he came across the land and chose the beast. And Beliar spoke to it, and the beast became his subject. And Beliar gave unto it a portion of his divine power. Hey, you! About those missing people. Yes? Let me tell you what I know. What have you found out? Nothing important so far. Lares said that you could help me get into the Monastery of the Fire Magicians. Is that your choice? The way of the fire? Yes, I want to become a fire magician. As far as I know, they gladly accept novices in their monastery. So why would you need my help? Lares mentioned that they demand a tribute before they let anyone into the monastery. I cannot grant you entry into the monastery myself. I am a water mage, as you know, but... I am very well acquainted with Darren, the Fire Magician. He spends most of his time in the marketplace, collecting alms for his church. But I have heard that he is not only in town to raise some funds. He told me about a statuette that was stolen from him. It was very important to him. He will surely allow you to enter the monastery if you can get it back for him. Of course, if you should decide to join the Circle of Fire, you can still become a member of the ring, if you prove yourself worthy, that is. Can you heal me? Adonis, bless this body. Free it of its wounds and strengthen it with new life. you filthy brute. Wait until Lord Andre hears of this. Hey, you! I met Valentino, and I gave him a sound beating. <laughs> he deserved it. Here, I found this ring on him when our little disagreement had been settled. You're welcome to pass it on to the next person who beats him up. But no, he insisted he knew better. Someone's got to do the work. It had to happen sooner or later. That's the first I've heard of it. I don't believe you have a lie on that. Don't say it's into the rack. 
How about your approval, Master? Has Vatras given you his blessing? Yes. And did you also get the blessing of a priest of Inos? Yes, I did. Then you shall have my blessing as well. No matter what path you decide to take, take pride in doing a good job, my boy. How's it going? How much do you want? What do you mean, how much? I'm the money lender and you came to me. What could you want from me? Money, of course. Well, lend me some money. Sure, how much would you like? I charge 20%. 1,000 gold coins. You got a couple of screws loose or something? I'll give you 100. And don't forget, I want it back tomorrow. You always throw your money at people like that? Don't worry, you'll be back. Otherwise, I'll find you and kill you. It's that simple. You've got such a distinctive mug that it wouldn't take long for me to find you. So don't even think about playing around with me. I used the spell scroll. Fine, fine. And were you successful? Yes, it worked. Excellent. One small success for science, but a big one for me. Now, I can use my time to instruct you in the arts of alchemy. I could also give you some useful things if you want. Show me your wares. Instruct me in the art of alchemy. To prepare a potion at the alchemist bench, you need a laboratory flask. And you're going to need different plants or other ingredients for each potion. Halt! No one may enter the storeroom! Why can't anyone enter the storeroom? The Honorable Lord Hagen has confiscated the goods for the King's army!
damn it, what do you want? What are you up to? What are you sneaking around here for? Halt! No one may enter the storeroom! Show me your wares. No funny business. One more step and I'll hack you to bits.
Nothing there. 